Hello. Welcome to Whispers and Wishes Boutique. How may I be of assistance today? Mm-hmm. Wonderful. So you're looking for a gift for a friend. All right. Is it any special occasion in particular? Oh, their birthday. Is, is there a specific item that you've been on the lookout for? Oh, our magical lamps. We do get quite a few customers in here each week for our lamps. Are you familiar with magic lamps at all? Hmm? All right. Well, would you like me to take just a moment to uh, go over the variety of lamps that we do offer here at Whispers and Wishes? First, I must tell you that uh, many of our customers come in here with the common misconception that a magical lamp must be a lamp and that within them you'll only find genies who grant the traditional three wishes. However, this is far from the truth. There are actually a variety of different types of containers that you'll find here as well as a myriad of different types of magical beings that you'll find within these containers. And while some may grant three wishes, others grant ten, and others grant just one. And some of them even have special caveats to their wishes. For example, let me show you one of our, our most popular lamps that I have in stock today. This particular lamp here, as you can see, is actually a bottle. It's a beautiful lavender-colored glass bottle. This is hand-blown glass, of course. And on the outside, you'll find delicately drawn images of roses and lilacs and daffodils. These are all hand-painted. And you'll notice at the top here, it's sealed very neatly with a solid gold stopper or cork, if you will. Now this particular lamp does not hold a genie at all. It actually holds a wish fairy. Now these special fairies are able to grant the holder four wishes. The caveat to these wishes is that they must further mankind in some way. So this is a very humanist bottle, if you will, a very altruistic bottle. For instance, the wish cannot be necessarily for personal gain, unless that particular instance of personal gain will further the entire human race. This bottle is only 27 gold pieces. I actually have it discounted this week. And then this next bottle over here is made of brass and copper. And the stopper, as you'll note, is your traditional wooden cork. You simply activate this bottle by gently blowing on the emblem that's on the side here. Mm -hmm. Now, within this particular bottle is actually a witch. At some point in their lives, all witches must choose a path. And some good witches find that their path lies within wish granting. And this sort of vessel is the most appropriate for them. 
as they are able to affect the most people and grant the most wishes, as they are continually passed on to different individuals. This bottle has 49 gold pieces, and the holder of the bottle is given five wishes, with no restrictions upon the wish that can be granted. This next magical lamp here is in fact the traditional magical lamp. It is made out of terracotta. hand sculpted perfectly. A bit of a beveled edge around its surface. This lamp will grant its holder three wishes, and it does in fact contain a genie. This particular item is 14 gold pieces is our least expensive. And we feel it's the most typical. I must warn you, however, that we have no prior knowledge of the sort of genie that is within these lamps. So, yes, you will be taking a bit of a risk, as some genies are known to be a bit hostile while others may be perfectly friendly and amiable. Mm -hmm. And we have this next one here. This is actually a wooden box. And within this wooden box is an elf. And this elf been given the task of granting wishes. Some help to make shoes, others help jolly men to deliver presents. <laughs> I think you know who I'm talking about. And then some choose the path of granting wishes, or assigned the task rather elves are always assigned a particular job when they are born. I can tell you for a fact that there is an older elf in this particular wooden box. He is quite nice. I have um, heard from the previous owner that he was quite pleasant. He will grant two wishes. This box is 32 gold pieces. The caveat to this box is that those two wishes only last one year, so the effects of the wish wear off after a year, as he has limited powers. Mm. This final container I'd like to show you is another bottle. This is actually a converted wine bottle with a silver cork. And in this bottle is yet another genie. And this genie is able to grant seven wishes. Mm -hmm. However, the caveat to this particular bottle each of the seven wishes must be made on a particular day of the week and within a one week time frame from when the bottle is received. So for instance, if you give the bottle to your friend on a Tuesday, they must make that wish, the first wish, that Tuesday and then the second on that Wednesday, and so on. And then when they are done, they must store the bottle for a five-year duration, and then give it 
to a friend. They cannot reuse the bottle, of course. None of these items can be reused by the same person. But they may be passed on to another individual once they are done making their wishes. As you can see from the tag, this is quite reasonably priced, especially given that it is for seven wishes. Mm -hmm. Now, is there any particular bottle, lamp, or container that you may be interested in? Mm -hmm. That's a wonderful And would you like for me to gift wrap it for you? Wonderful. I'll go ahead and do that now for you then. Feel free to browse around the shop while I'm wrapping up your gift. Here's the, here's the item, and yes, you have the gold pieces for me. you'd like to return it, you do have 14 days. You can bring it back and exchange it for another item of equal value. All right. Wonderful. It's been a pleasure meeting you, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.